are LMTV, Lynn Mar Television, now in our 10th year of award-winning broadcast excellence. Lynn Mar, your news starts now. Good morning, Lynn Mar. It's Wednesday, November 7th, 2012. And here's a look at the stories making news on your Lynn Mar campus. Our top story, the campaign ads are over. Yeah! Woo! The president was re-elected to another four-year term. Our network partner, Channel One, will have complete coverage today at 3.15 on LMTV. In other news, Chris Knudsen, a former Linmar student and Air Force second lieutenant, will be in the MOC during fifth period today and available in the counseling office in the afternoon. Stop by and visit with him about careers in the Air Force. He will be speaking at to Linmar Armed Services Club after school. Linmar, do you part... Do your part to help those affected by Hurricane Sandy. Tomorrow and Friday before school, stop by the Four Corners. There will be a bake sale and donation box where you can give a few dollars to help millions of people affected by Hurricane Sandy. We'll be back with more LMTV News right after this. Hi, I'm Nupur Anani. I interned last summer at the Gazette, and now I feel really confident that marketing is what I want to pursue in college. Are you unsure about your future career? Check out Workplace Learning Connection Internships and see Mrs. Zygtima. Applications are due November 9th. Go to workplace-learning.org to find out more. Welcome back. Any freshmen interested in hearing about and becoming a member of Student Council, please come to the Little Theater next Wednesday morning at 8 a.m. We need your voice. We need your leadership. We need you. Come here what we, come here what we are about and enjoy a donut on your way out. Once again, that's next Wednesday morning at 8, 8 a.m. in the Little Theater. Now Sarah joins us with sports. Zoe joins us with sports. It's all right. In the wide world of Linmar sports, the 2000 football award, 2012 football awards will be presented tonight at 5 in the auditorium. All freshmen, sophomore, and varsity football players and their families are invited to attend. All girls interested in going out for track this spring, listen up. There will be a short meeting on, in the study mall on Monday at 345 in the if you can't make it, stop by the study mall during third and fourth block or contact Coach Hop in the study mall for more information. FCA is hosting a dodgeball tournament Friday, November 16th in the six, at 6 p.m. in the auxiliary gym. Get your teams together and sign up with Mr. Hefley. No team, no problem. Bring friends for an evening of fun, food, and fellowship. Jay, Set Sports, back to you. Thanks, Zoe. And news from the counselors. A rep from the Luther College will be in the counseling office today at 10.15. A rep from the Barbizon College will be in the lower commons today at, during all four lunch periods. Applications for internships through the Workplace Learning Connections are due Friday. See Ms. Sigma to find out more. For more on the internships, scholarships, and upcoming college visits, stop by the counseling office or check out our website. Now Sarah joins us with the Arts and Clubs. Thanks. On the arts and clubs scene, the Linmar Drama Department will present Brighton Beach Memoirs Thursday, Friday, and Saturday night at 7.30 in the Little Theater. Tickets are just $5 each or free with your activity pass. Trap Shootles will practice tonight at 6 p.m. At, at the North Lynn Fish and Game Club in Central City. Questions? See Mr. Pilcher, room G143B. Come join the new Linmar Latin Club. There will be an informational meeting tomorrow morning at 8 in Mr. Tracy Hopkins' room. No prior knowledge of Latin is required. The annual Soda Co-Ed Volleyball Tournament is Friday at 6 p.m. 6.30 p.m. in High School Gym. This event is open to all Limmar High School students. Stop in at Mr. Colley's, Mr. McCauley's office to get your team in entry form. That's your club update. Chase, back to you. Thanks, Sarah. Now, Zoe, tell me, what is for lunch today? Well, it's a chicken patty sandwich with corn and mixed fruit. The other lines will offer the yogurt bar, pizza, the salad bar, or all the card items. The food court opens the famous pasta bar. That's lunch. Back to you. It's, pretty, it's a pretty nice morning out there. Our LMTV forecast calls for a partly sunny skies today with a high of 45. Tomorrow will be sunny and 53, and Thursday, sunny and warmer with a high of 57. That wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. Just go to the high school website or check us out on Twitter. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Join us again tomorrow and make it a great day, Linmar.